Are you hearing a lot about pox? Pox went from something that was really underdiagnosed to now it's overdiagnosed. So what exactly is pox? Postural orthostatic tachycardia syndrome. Okay, it belongs to a family known as dysautonomia. Okay, so dysregulation in the autonomic nervous system. When we look at this, okay, you've got objective findings. And with POTS, really, there's a lack of objective findings. Based upon criteria, you're only looking at two different objective findings, really. One is you need to see heart rate changes of greater than 30 beats per minute when you go from laying to standing. And two, you should have no blood pressure drops. That's about it, okay? Outside of it, you shouldn't have any other objective findings because that would be an explanation for something else. Now, outside of that, you get a lot of subjective findings within POTS as well, right? You get multi-system involvement. So you may have neurological issues, brain fog, fatigue, headaches, dizziness. You may have musculoskeletal based issues, joint pain, neck pain. You may have immune system issues, right? You may have gut issues, bloating, constipation, diarrhea, and much more. So I hope this helps you. This is what POTS is. This is the first one in a series we are doing on postural or tachycardia syndrome. Until next time, I'm Dr. Z, and I'm known as the Brain Man.